if you look at the data, scary word, I know, but if you look at the data, over the last 40 years, there is an increased demand for college graduate students. Okay, that's why everyone is going to get a college degree. So let's look at the average male who completed a college. The likelihood of that male to work in a good job was actually decreased over time. In contrast, when we look at females, the likelihood of that college graduate female to work in a good job actually increased. That's what got us interested. What's happening here? There is ample evidence in neuroscience, in psychology, in economics, that females have a comparative advantage in social skills, in communication, in what I'm doing with you right now. Let's go and check and measure whether there has been an increase in the demand for these social skills and whether it was more so in the better jobs, in the good jobs, in the high paying jobs, in the cognitive jobs. These are all synonymous. How do we do that? Without getting into the old boring technicalities, there are data sets that basically measure very specific narrow occupation, what is required to be done. We can measure point, different points in time, what are the required tasks. When I started uh, being a economist, we never did videos. We didn't have to do this kind of social skill communication. Nowadays, it's part of the job. In my data set then, it will be shown as that an economist 15 years ago could have been just a nerd. Now you have to be a nerd and be able to communicate that you're a nerd. And what we show is that there has been an increase in social skills, but more so in the upper spectrum of the good jobs. So think about the first fact I said, take it as given, females have a comparative advantage in social skills, okay? Second, we document the importance of social skills in the labor market. And the third fact, this increase in importance has been stronger in good paying jobs. When you combine them all together, you get that females who have a comparative advantage. So an increase in the demand for social skills and more so in good paying job, putting all together, that is consistent with the fact that we started at the beginning about why females are doing better relatively than men over this time period.